Health workers at Mbandaka Airport screen passengers to prevent the spread of Ebola. The deadly disease has changed the way people interact in this northwestern part of the DRC. And the Director General of the World Health Organization, Tedros Ghebreyesus, knows there's no more shaking of hands here. He's on a tour of a village called Itipo to check the progress made in tackling Ebola. The first case was reported in the DRC's Equator province last month. 27 people lost their lives. The latest Ebola case was reported here last week, but authorities say the situation has improved. At least one or two persons died because of Ebola and the team was completely uh, disappointed. Okay? And since I'm working in here, we didn't see any case, new case of Ebola. The Congolese government is working with international agencies to contain the disease. And the progress made so far is something officials are proud of. The latest case was reported here in Etipo. We will monitor the patient for 21 days and then ensure that we get rid of this disease. But the government is not taking any chances. Efforts have been stepped up to bring a swift end to Ebola. Health experts here are employing a method called ring vaccination to contain the spread of Ebola. It involves tracking the disease by following up on all people who have been in contact with confirmed cases and getting them vaccinated. But it hasn't been easy to get the suspected cases given the poor road network in the area. The collaboration of medics and aid agencies has nonetheless helped reduce the spread of Ebola. Some of the patients who survived the disease are impressed with the medical attention they have been given. The doctors treated us so well. They gave us food, water and strict rules about containing the disease. Although there has been a significant improvement in checking the spread of the fatal virus, the World Health Organization chief says there's need for more vigilance. We have to be vigilant and we have to continue to strengthen our surveillance and especially identification of cases and also contact tracing so we contain any uh, further uh, spread. This is the ninth outbreak of Ebola in the DRC. The first was reported in 1976 at River Ebola in northern DRC. Chris Sochamringa, CGTN, Bandaka, Democratic Republic of Congo.